Okay, team, so I am going to talk about happiness some more because there's a lot to talk about here. And uh, I will start, though, with some fun things. It's all fun at this point. <coughs> Got a couple of little extra pieces. Just wanted to show you this one. So <laughs> this is a meme, a little meme action, uh, but it is from an academic, so people are having fun with these things. <laughs> this is pretty out there. Uh, I don't know if you've seen this as a meme in general, right? The whatever, whatever, yeah, okay. What is it again? It's American Chopper? Okay, <laughs> specifically. Um, so this is Vanderbilt Milton's 2001 AGS, right? American Journal of Sociology shows tetracycline wasn't spread by advice networks, but by advertising. So this is, an, you know, this is an influence thing, right? This is how, does, how did social contagion work? And the, the sort of, it's not actually by, you know, through social networks, but actually straight up advertising. And then only because Pfizer was advertising a high efficacy innovation from an established product category with high legitimacy, right? So it's not actually, um, and then, and <laughs> which I talk about in Pox, right? This is the uh, work on influentials. Only works in preferential attachment graphs, which is sort of true. Yeah, I mean, that's, you know, but is common. Com <laughs> Oh my God, what's it say? Oh, when is the last time you saw an Erdős Rennie graph? <laughs> <laughs> so then there's the parallel, you know, Barabasi Clausette nonsense of scale free networks don't exist. You know, there's some other version of that as well. Anyway, I think Ryan Gallagher, who was, uh, yeah, he sent this and, uh, and he's been making his own memes <laughs> since then. He made one for, he made one for uh, Simon versus Mandelbrot based on based on what you've seen in Puck. So uh, anyway, his career is taking off. Uh, so yeah, you have a section in your CV, which is memes constructed, you know, <laughs> <and> like <laughs> papers, memes, 